All right, everybody. This is me and Michael. Second day of chicken snares. I got Michael with me today. Still by myself. So we're gonna go in, check snares, and we'll get back to you when we get into the snares, and we'll check snares and see if we got a rabbit today. Hopefully we do. All right, see you then. Hi, everybody. Rich snares. First one, we got nothing. Walk down here, see if we got one down here. Aha! We got a bunny on the second snare today. Yeah. No, come here. Yeah. Come here. All right, everybody. So, we got a rabbit here today. So, the moment I said, I'm going to get him to take a video of me taking the rabbit out of the snare. Okay. Come here. Now, keep it on its side and move back so you can get the all right, everybody, so here's our little bunny. He ain't long died, and my God, he got a lot of kinks in the snare, but that's good, so I can show you guys what kinks looks like. Okay. That's a male rabbit, too. So this is a young male. Try to get the snare off his neck, because it's a little bit hard trying to get the snare off the rabbit's neck, but I'm just going to have to. Stay tuned, may I suppose? Okay, I got in some work there. See, in yesterday's video, I didn't have Michael with me, so I couldn't take a video of me taking the rabbit out of the snare. But today I got Michael, which is good, so he can take videos of me getting the rabbit out of the snare. Okay, here he is, everybody. That is a nice jack is what we call male rabbits here in Newfoundland. He is a very, very big rabbit. He is long. Okay. I'm going to come down here and I'll show the people this. Remember in yesterday's video when I said there was kinks in the snare, you have to reset it. So right here, we got a kink here, a kink here, a kink here, and a kink here. So maybe I'll focus so you can see. So one here, one here. One right here and one here, right? So that's kinks. See how easy that just bust? Right? You do not want that to happen. You want to prevent that from happening. So I'll keep this here for now until I get some new snare set there. For when another rabbit comes through. So let's reset the snare. Well, Michael, your snare did a good job today. Yeah, I did myself. This is your snare. I just pricked myself. <laughs> that hurts really bad. But I'm used to it because I've caught so many rabbits in my life that, you know, don't really affect me anymore. Well, I'm really happy to get one today. Hopefully, we'll get one in the next couple of snares, but uh, I'm going to set another snare in a second. If I can ever get these snares took apart here. Okay. <sighs> <laughs> so, you just unraveled the snare. Right? I usually take my snare and opens them up. So, do if I want some. I just bend them in a circle like that. Then you take your snare, put it around the stick, and twist them like that. And you just keep twisting until you have a little bit of water left, and you know that just like that. So you open your snare up like that, put your snare down like that, and block now again. Block now again, no sense. Every rap we get from now on is I have everything demolished. So, see, I'll show you a good trick now. Now, you see these boughs here? If you find a tree with boughs on them like that, spruce tree, burr tree, whatever, you can take these boughs and they are really good for blocking off rabbit snares. Since that the rabbit where the rabbit's run to now is in under cut down 
for our trees. So that is a good thing because he won't know that we was here. So get some more bows. Some more bows here. Black this all up. You want nowhere for where the rabbit can get around your snare because then you won't have rabbit. <laughs> so like I said in the first video, take some sticks and put it around like that. Right. Another stick. And you don't have to be straight, but I kind of like some straight because they're easier to use, but you don't have to be. Okay. So that's another snare set there. And wait, now I should put a couple. Uh, put a couple. Um, chin up, chin up, there. So the rabbit will go through. Here's a squirrel. Here's a squirrel. Yes. Them beautiful. <laughs> All right. Now you never want to leave your used wire in the woods. So we take our wire, bring it home, and put it to use for something else. Okay, Michael. So follow me. We'll go check some more here. So, put the rabbit on the front of my bike, and we'll go down and check the other stairs now. Maybe you follow me. We got one rabbit, a very nice rabbit. And so I'm happy, really happy with that. So that's good. And he's a nice rabbit too. So he'll be going good for eating. So maybe later, I got two rabbits clean now. So maybe later I'll get a, a just to show you how to clean a rabbit video on the go see how that goes and so i will probably do one of them and we'll have another video tomorrow of checking the snares tomorrow so uh please like and subscribe and there'll be a lot more videos like this coming up of hunting and fishing anything like that and so uh See you on the next video tomorrow. Peace out.